I've never quite gotten over my resentment that Alakazam is trade evolution only. Abra is a curious design. It looks vaguely like a Japanese fox, but mixed with a sort of insectoid segmented body and a long fat tail that looks lizard-like to me. This continues into Kadabra, who adds sagely moustache and a spoon to make reference to the fake psychic trick of spoon bending. The tail also gets really fat, which again reads lizard to me, and the claws get more aggressive and pronounced. And then, with Alakasam, the tail just disappears, which I'm not sure why that is, but it makes the creature more anthropomorphic, more human-like, and its ears become horns instead, along with that extended edition of the Moustache. Perhaps it's all to evoke the image of a human magician. Mega Alakasam certainly takes that idea and runs with it, and between the sudden giant beard and the robe-like sleeves, it leans fully into the implications of magic inherent in its name. The line feels a bit unfocused, though, and relies on a sense of bizarreness to communicate its spooky power, which is fine, but not the best communication of psychic power even within Gen 1. Subscribe to this channel for more reactions and hot takes, or head on over to my main channel for longer in-depth videos.